Google Apps makes it easy and convenient to search, use, and modify copyright-free material. Let's say I want to find a picture of a puppy. I would type in the word puppy, click on images, and I would get my results here. By clicking on the gear symbol and going to my settings, I can click on advanced search. By scrolling down under usage rights, I can now select my filter by free to use, share or modify, even commercially, and click advanced search. Now, all of my results will appear as copyright free for public use. The second way is using Google Drive. Let's say I have a Google presentation and I want to insert a picture of a puppy. I would click insert, image, and then I would click search. Now I have the option of using Google, Life, or stock images. And if you notice, it says results shown are labeled for commercial reuse with modification. So let's say I type in puppy and I get my results for Google. I can search any type and any color. But let's say I want to use a stock photo. I find the one I want and click select. In just a few seconds, I'll have a beautiful picture of a puppy. The third way is with YouTube. With a YouTube video editor, I can click edit and go to the Creative Commons search, which allows me to search for videos that are free for public use. So let's say I want to find a video of a puppy. I could search and scroll down and find the video that I'd like to use. So I'll insert this into my video editor and this will allow me to edit, add text, or even crop the video any way I'd like. So remember, the next time you need to use copyright free material, be sure to use Google Apps.